Curfew hours in the 13 counties identified as COVID-19 hotspots in the Lake Region have been revised from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. It is National Health Status Update Address. Health Cabinet Secretary Mutahi Kagwe has also announced that all political gatherings have been suspended immediately in a bid to curtail the spread of COVID-19. Mariam Jahid with more details. COVID-19 pandemic has been ravaging the country for a year now and many Kenyans thought it will just pass but as the COVID-19 cases increases it is sure that they have to learn to live by it. The government has revised curfew hours for the 13 Lake Region counties that were designated COVID-19 hotspots and curfew will now begin at 10 p.m. from 7 p.m. and end at 4 a.m. like the rest of the country. As the hours of the ongoing national curfew to continue across the country from 10 p.m. and 4 a.m. This applies now to the counties in the Lake Region as well. In the new COVID-19 containment guidelines issued by the Minister of Health, all public gatherings, including political rallies, are suspended as well as intergovernmental meetings. In line with the directive to avoid crowded places, where transmission has been shown to be more likely, we once again emphasize that all public gatherings and in-person meetings of whatever nature are suspended countrywide. In this regard, all governments, including intergovernmental meetings and conferences, should henceforth be converted to either virtual or postponed. Kenyans had this to say on political gatherings. Naona serikali ili funga hapo kwa sawa. Kwa sababu wakati tunagusanyika mali pamoja naona kwamba kuna ongezeko la visa vya hii virus. Kwa hivyo naomba serikali iende vile vile. The cabinet secretary has also directed that barriers should be conducted within 72 hours to reduce the number of times people meet and barriers should be attended by 50 people only. We have also emphasized that GAO will forthwith and they will be calling a meeting, Interior will be calling a meeting to discuss this matter with chiefs, sub-chiefs and other enforcement agencies to ensure that... Uh, Funerals are attended by the 50 people that we had proposed earlier. It has been noted that the positivity rate in the country has increased. The Minister of Health has urged Kenyans to adhere to the guidelines that have been put in place to combat COVID-19 cases. However, the scheduled meeting of President Uhuru Kenyatta in Western Region remains in limbo because the public gatherings have been suspended immediately. Mariam Jahid reporting from the office of the President, Nairobi. Thank you, Mariam Jahid.